2009 draws to a close. We thought we'd take a look back at a wonderful family. The Henriksons have not one, not two, but three sets of twins. The last set was just born in July. They're doing great. But CBS News correspondent Kelly Cobier reports that it's double trouble times three. Kathleen Henriksen has her arms full this summer. She's a mom times two, times two, times two. Kathleen and her husband Nick are the proud and tired parents of three sets of twins. How did that happen? <laughs> it wasn't planned. <laughs> it wasn't. No, no, we never really talked about that. No. But it wasn't exactly an accident either. A year into their marriage, the couple had trouble conceiving, so they tried in vitro fertilization. The doctor implanted two embryos and Austin and Tyler were born. Um, I think we were really terrified at first, you know, oh my God, twins, how do you take care of twins? I can't imagine ever even doing one. Because everybody talks even... negatively, they say, oh, just wait, you know, so we were like, okay. <laughs> they adjusted so well, in fact, that soon Kathleen was talking babies again. I guess we wanted to try for a girl. Yep. Again, <laughs> so <laughs> went back to the IVF doctor and we tried one more time. And again, we ended up with twins again. <laughs> Hunter and Chase, two more boys. Kathleen desperately wanted a girl, but first she had to convince Nick. I begged for like a year. I tried everything under the sun. I begged and begged until I think finally he was like, just let's go, okay? And um, I know at that time he was like, well, at least we'll definitely only have one. There's no way that, you know, God is gonna give us another set of twins. They were wrong. Chase your brother. Dylan was born in June, along with his one and only sister, Summer. What's next? Any more kids? Mm, no. <laughs> in this house, six is enough for everyone. Kelly Cobiella, CBS News, North Miami Beach. Oh, my heart goes out to him. Now, there are no statistics on the odds of having three sets of twins with the help of fertility drugs. Without the treatment, however, they're more li likely to be struck by lightning, which, Harry, they might feel like they have been. <laughs>